from our right to left as we are situated here in the press box. And Mike Elston will do the honors. One of the top shot putters in the state. Elston, a six foot five inch, 220 pound junior. And certainly one of Coach Bachman's key personnel. They say Mike Elston is uh, one fine, outstanding athlete, and uh, I hear he's one of his, he's probably his best sports baseball, and he doesn't even play that. And the kickoff is, it goes into the end zone for a touchback, the first we've seen of that nature all season long. So Wapa Canetta will be operating on a first and 10 from their own 20-yard line. What a we have gained. Two wideouts here to the near side. Link takes the snap, rolls, and throws, and the pass complete up to the 35-yard line for a 15-yard pickup to Wapa Canetta's Brian Crumrine. As Link with the rollout, Crumrine, a little down and in, split backs, two guys wide out to the left. Uh, Teeters, the tight end. Aaron Link takes the snap this time, rolls to his left. Pass is incomplete for Crumrine at the 45-yard line. J5, handoff comes to the... The tailback, Nate Cornell, for very short yardage off uh, right guard to about the 36. A host of Redskin or uh, Rough Rider tacklers, including uh, Tim Connerty. Peters is the tight end for Wapa Canetta. Aaron Link takes the snap, rolls to his left, and is sacked back at the 28-yard line. That was Rough Rider Travis Chilcote, a 190-pound junior. Uh, Got Scott Fisher with the punt. It's taken at the 33-yard line by the Rough Riders. The return to midfield, a 17-yard punt return by Chet Nouse, the junior, the 1,500-yard man last year as a sophomore, and he is extremely quick in the Rough Rider offense formation. Fred Fry, the quarterback, handoff to the big guy, Elston, for only a yard to the Wapakoneta 49. Let's see who got in there for the Redskins. One of the guys, Jason Brown, a 205-pound junior, will set back, so wing right, handoff, big fullback up to the, down, I should say, to the Wapakoneta 44-yard line. That, of course, is Mike Compton, the 205-pound senior. Bolt B. There it is. The snap. There's the big fullback, Compton, and he will be stopped short of a first down, and Wapakoneta's Jason Brown with his third great tackle, and on fourth, and about a yard. Will Wapakoneta defense with the excellent stand there, shutting down the Riders. Bad snap. Elston fields it nevertheless. Hits a liner, and it's going to roll. It's going to land in the air on the goal line for a touchback. And once again, Wapakoneta will take over at their own 20-yard line, facing a first and 10. It's a scoreless tie with still 8-17 to play. Firkin, uh, hang in there, Luke. Things will look better, believe me. Aaron Link on a first and 10 for Wapakoneta, and he will, the pass is ruled incomplete to Brian Crumrine at the 32-yard line. The ball bounced into Crumrine's hands, who caught to the left, tight end tight to the near side. Link fakes the handoff, looks to throw. Nobody's open. QB Link going to run with it, and he will get stopped back at the 18-yard line. Greg Liette, a 260-pound senior, too much for Aaron Link to handle. Set back, Aaron Link takes the snap on a third and 12, rolls to his left, looks to throw, can't get the pass off, and gets swaddled up as uh, St. Mary's Matt Clement, another 260-pounder. And he did there again. We could have been in really poor field position because the wind is at his face. Fred Fry, senior quarterback. Quick handoff comes to Chet now. now. Quickly steps outside, gets across midfield, scrambles for additional yardage to the 46-yard line. As three, they will certainly keep it on the ground. And that's Mike Compton. He will, or Nouse again, I think. Elston. But Mike Elston. Elston, pardon me. And he will easily get the first down to the yard line. We'll say the 42. Fred Fry, senior quarterback, single wide out. May have been a motion, but no call. There's uh, Compton on the carry, and he tries the right side and storms down to about the 39-yard line for three more yards. Take it second and six. Play action. Fry rolls to his right, throws the football wide open, and a rough rider touchdown. Greg Walter, a 39-yard touchdown pass. From Fred Fry to the big tight end, Greg Walter, who is set. The kick is up, and it's through, but a flag thrown before that. And we'll wait and see what that's all about. 6 nothing Rough Riders, illegal motion. St. Mary's, they'll back him up. They'll get another try. There's, this time, he'll boot it from the 15th, so it's a 25-yarder, and he's not going to make this one. It's wide to the left, so the conversion kick is unsuccessful. 
score remains. St. Mary's Memorial 6, Wapakoneta nothing. We're back with the kickoff and more action just ahead. This is... Country T-102. And we are back at Harmon Field, Wapakoneta High School. Mike Elston for St. Mary's. Booms a kickoff. The wind at his back, by the way. It's fumbled into the end zone. And Wapakoneta going to return it. Nate Cornell, uh-uh. They're going to say it was down uh, for a touchback. A break for Nate Cornell. Find here to the near side. Handoff comes to the tailback. Nate Cornell for one yard to the 21. Second and a long eight. Aaron Link this time straight drop. Throws the football. It's complete to Mark Schlosser at the 27-yard line for about five yards on the pickup. That's on the third and a long two. Split backs. Link drops. Looks to throw a little screen. Complete to Cornell. Across the 30. Will get the first down for Wapakoneta. Their second first down. And uh, Cornell with the reception and ran for a couple of good yards. Got to like the play call there, huh? Nice. The tight end, tight here to the near side on the first and ten. Hand off to Cornell, gets a good block from Teeters. Dives across the 30, up to near the 34-yard line. And Lake hand, fakes the handoff, will keep the football. 35, hammered at the 37, shoved out of bounds. As another one of those active Rough Rider backers, Travis Chilcote, you mentioned a little bit, to either side. Dual setbacks. Tight end is Teeters, tight to the, the far side. Link takes the snap. Good block. He has time in the pocket and goes down the sidelines to Cronrod, who makes the reception for a first down at the 32-yard line. A 31-yard pass play for Wapakoneta. And first down number three for the Redskins. And Krumrai, with a falling down reception, had beat his man. There's in that situation. First to 10, Wapakoneta from the St. Mary's 32. Handoff Scott Fisher doing some banging there in the trenches on that left-hand side for maybe a yard, not too much more. A rough rider, strong. Second and nine, Aaron Link, lots of times, going to run with the football. 30, and storms over a rough rider tackler down to the 28-yard line. Three, maybe four yards for Wapakoneta, but a little windy now. Third and six, big play for Wapakoneta. Link with time, looks to throw, is going to run it. 35, correction, 25, 24, short of a first down. High formation, senior quarterback Aaron Link takes a snap, hands off to Cornell, stuffed on a fourth and one. A loss back to the 25-yard line as that very stiff, rough rider defense led by Matt Clements for uh, St. Mary's. Wapakoneta Redskins football here on American Country T-102. And very quickly back to action as we start second quarter action. Big guy Walter here to the near side. Fry bobbles the snap. Fred's going to fall forward to the 35. Still got a couple, almost three yards out of that. Hey, first down. First and 10 from the 35. Handoff comes to who? Compton fumble? No, but a flag on the play. Canetta moves the football to the Redskin. 49-yard line. Handoff to the first man through. Probably Mike Compton. We'll see. In six nothing Rough Riders. Fred Fry fumbles the football. Fry very alert. Falls on it. They'll lose a couple of yards. Back to the 48. Rich Van Voorhees and Wapakoneta's Jason Brown there uh, defensively. So now the Riders facing a third full setbacks. It's the wing T formation. The handoff comes to Elston. A little trickery there. A, do a double handoff. The initial to Compton, who quickly shoveled it to Elston. He's going to be held short of a first down. Only about a two or three yard pickup away from his own 45. Two guys back deep for the Redskins. Winters and kick and the kick. Oh, it was tipped. Oh, they throw the flag. I can't believe it. The ball was clearly tipped. He hit the ball. And, of course, the Wapakoneta punt block man, that was Eric Sell, smashed into Mike Elston, the official there, threw the flag, but I can't believe that that football was not blocked. You'll agree, Jim Elshire? Wait. To pick it up. First and 10, Wapakoneta from the 18-yard line. Aaron Link throws to the wide open. Brad Keck streaking down the near sidelines. Pass a bit lengthy, certain touchdown written all over it. Link with the rollout, Keck just a straight sprint down the sidelines, had long since beat his man, whoever that was. One wide out to either side, Fisher now will shift to Aaron Link's uh, right flank. Aaron takes the snap, rolls to his left, looks to throw. Decides not, well, he'll let it fly and way overthrows 
Brian Crumrine down the far sidelines. Smaller, so people don't know how big we are. I know you always have done that. <laughs> Aaron Link, third and ten. Sometime, oh, protection breaks down. Aaron wisely ditches it. Was it a complete pass behind the line of scrimmage? You know, it was a complete pass from Aaron Link to Jason Elsie. He shoved out along the far sidelines. A return up to the 47-yard line, where it's first and 10 Rough Riders with 8.02 to play. Second quarter action. Their own 47-yard line, Fred Fry hands off to Mike Compton. Bullies his way to the Wapakin at a 47 for six yards. On the pickup, five officially for St. Mary's from the Wapakoneta 48. Handoff comes to Elston, who is caught from behind for a two-yard loss on a spectacular play by Wapakoneta's Jason Brown, the 205-pound junior. Rough Riders with the football, power eye formation. Handoff comes to Elston, carries the football for about one yard off left tackle, and... I think Jason Brown, number 61, yes indeed, made the tackle once again. Flippikin at a betwixt the 10 and the 15, Brad Keck and Chris Winters. Here's the kick by Elston, hits a liner, bounds. Keck's going to leave it go. Rough Riders will down it at the Wapakin at a 14-yard line near the 15. And with us, we talk to the coach of the league champions. First and 10, Redskins link, takes a snap. Aaron with some openings. 15, up to near the 17, almost the 18-yard line. Good 18-yard line. High formation. Aaron Link a bit confused in this offensive set. Right Once right. from their own 18-yard line. High formation. Uh, faked handoff to the fullback, and now Aaron Link will be sacked. Back at the 15, a loss on the play. Rough rider Jeff Mabry, 100 dual setbacks in the third and nine. Wapakin at a certain to throw. They will. It's complete to Crumrine for a first down to the 30-yard line. A 15-yard pass play. And first down number four for Wapakoneta. And once again, Brian Crumrine, the man for Wapakoneta. Teeters the tight end. Hand off to Cornell. Not much. Straight up the middle. Very tough going in there. Travis Chilcote again. I think it's Cornell. Maybe Matt Noggle, the single set. Three wide outs. Aaron Link takes the snap, rolls, and throws. And it is wide of Brad Keck up at the 40-yard line near first down territory. Line of scrimmage their own 30. Aaron Link rolls. Heavily pressured. Taken down. Back at the 25-yard line. The excellent quickness of veteran linebacker senior, senior Vince Yale. Look at Scott nice Fisher ball. hits a bomb. It's fielded at the 20 yard at the 25 yard line by uh, the Rough Riders. Jody Pop fields it. He's tackled at the 30. What a kick! Power eye formation. Straight pitch to the big guy Elston. Cuts inside. Gets five to the 35 yard line like never before straight pitch this time to mike compton for not much room to the 37 rough riders fry with the delay handoff to uh to uh compton and he will be taken down for only about a two-yard gain stiff win redskins could get oh he shanks the kick but it'll take a rough rider roll to the wapakoneta 37 yard line is that Splitbacks, wideouts to either side. Teeters the tight end. Aaron Link drops back, looks to throw. Crum right is open, but the pass is overthrown at the 40-yard line. Nice effort by Crumrine. Chet Naus back there defensively along with uh, Elston. And, oh, hit. First and 25, Wapakoneta going to go with the aerial game here, but Link's got some room to run up to the 28, and Aaron almost had his head ripped off from behind for a final play, unless it's an incomplete pass. Let's see how they elect to handle this on a second down and 20. Wapakoneta from their own 28-yard line. Quick pass, they just uh, dump it. That'll stop the clock with fly. Single set, Link fumbles the snap. Time expires, it's halftime. Our score at Harmon Field, Wapakoneta High School in this matchup of longtime Western Buckeye League rivals. Unbeaten St. Mary's, the third-ranked team in the state, the defending state champion. Six, Wapakoneta, nothing. And all three of them are just really super kids. Lovely, they really are. Lovely young ladies. Wapakoneta to kick off. They've got the wind at their back. And Redskin Brian Jeffrey to do the honors from our right to left. And the wind picks it, and it bounces into the end zone for a touchback. 
Wing T formation. Fred Fry, handoff. Mike Compton, good yardage. Something All the way different. to the 35-yard line. Something really different. They ran it. First, First dive to the other side. Big Mike Elston bullies to the 42-yard line for six more yards on a first down. Second and four. St. Mary's from their own 41-yard line. Wing T formation. And a flag is thrown. Little doubt in my mind. Uh, the Rough Riders jumped a bit early, so it's going to be a legal procedure against St. Mary's. The comes uh, right to Chetnaus. Scampers his way across the 40 up to the 42 where it's going to be third and four. Has held that off. Third and four from the St. Mary's 42. Five. This is an important play. Oh, what a quick hitter. And a big yardage to the 45-yard line. A 13-yard pickup for the Rough Riders. First 205-pounder. And another one of those veteran players. He, by the way, was a 1,200-yard man last year. Right. First to 10 Rough Riders. Handoff comes to, I think, Compton again. Virtually no gain. Brian and Axe over there. On collision with Mike Elston. Darren not going to come back anytime soon. Second and nine. Rough Riders from the Wapakoneta 45. Handoff comes to Elston. And he is wrapped. The initial hit. Brian Axe, the 175-pound senior, wraps Elston around the waist and the rest of his story. So this is an important play. With the slot man left, the dual setbacks. Fry fakes the handoff, throws the football. It's tipped, and it is incomplete. Walter was open, but Mike Compton tipped the football as if it was intended for him and may have interfered Walter's attempt. Greg Walter may be the long snapper. Here it is. Elston with the kick. The heck of a kick into a strong win. Winner, Spare catches it, fumbles it, falls on it at the 14. You know, they don't want to make a mistake down here. Keck give us the football. Brad, Brad Keck wide out to the left. Crum Ryan to the right. Dual setbacks. Aaron Link. Option pitch here to the near side. Cornell cuts it upfield. 15, 16 yard line. Three, maybe four yards. Uh, almost said Coach Elshire from <laughs> Coach Bodek here. On the sidelines, Jason Rostefer is the center. He'll snap to Aaron Link, the senior QB. Drops back, pressured, and is snowed under as the Red Rough Riders got through there very, very quickly. And yeah, yeah, there's no question about that. That is tough. Third down, 13 for Wapakoneta. They are in a hole, and they play it conservative here. They're going to run the football. Scott Fisher gets the carry to about the 10 for a virtual no gain. All up. You don't want to do something that uh, you're going to lose it because uh, that's almost a certain point. Fisher end over end, but with that killer win, it's going to be a great kick. It's fielded by uh, Chet Naus at the 30, returns it to the 39-yard line. So uh, Scott Fisher in the air, my friends, that football. That's the best job, right, to be a kicker? Oh, certainly. You don't have to do anything. <laughs> have fun all that. Still make the bowl trips, you right? You betcha. Might even get a scholarship out of it. Rough Riders first to 10 from their own 39-yard line, and although they're leading 6-0, little doubt they would like to get more on the board because 6-0 is not safe. Hand off to who? I think Compton. it is Mike Compton. In the sheer. That's I haven't seen one and two in the last two ball games, so... Second and six, handoff to Elston. No gain to the back to the 45. And let's see. Brad Keck Really made the hit there for Wapakoneta as he went to Rough Probably Riders. Probably why. No, go ahead. Walter wide out to the right. The wing T. Fry fakes the handoff. Will throw the football. It's in the air, and it is. Oh, it was tipped. Almost intercepted, but a completion to the 25-yard line. What a tough break for Wapakoneta. And Rough Riders, 25 yards away from Pater. And a two-touchdown lead in this game could be insurmountable. They'll run the football, probably Compton with the carry for about four yards. We'll see who comes up from that pile. The Canetta 21-yard line. Fred Fry, quick handoff, now switches directions, uh, cuts against the grain. 20 near the 19-yard line, taken down well before first down yardage. Now it's really just cut to his left. Sometimes St. Mary's will do that. They'll trap the second man because uh, of the way that uh, the tackles are playing. Big play here, third and four at the Wapakoneta 18. Fry fakes the handoff, throws the football. It's complete to Elston, and he is shoved out at the one-yard line, almost to the goal line. Brad Keck over there for Wapakoneta, a 17-yard pass play. First down, number eight 
for St. to Woody Hayes. Rough Rider quarterback Fred Fry on the keep across the goal line. Touchdown, St. Mary's. Three minutes, 18 seconds to play. Third quarter. Hey, youngster. Power eye formation. They're going to try for the two-point two-point conversion. Fry rolls and overthrows a wide-open Mike Elston. It's tough to throw when you're running, but uh, uh, actually a bad play, frankly, by Fred Fry as Elston was just... Rider kickoff following the touchdown fielded by uh, Wapakena and a short return to about the 35 yard line. So he means, right? Well, can't get panicky here. Just got to get something going. Aaron Link drops back, looks to throw, complete to Crumrine up to the 45 yard line. That'll be a first down for Wapakena on the 11 yard completion. Yeah, Brian split wide out to the left. Another guy wide to the right. Straight eye formation. First and 10, Wapakoneta, their own 45-yard line. They haven't had much better field position this year. Link with some pressure. One-step drop, tries to find the tight end. Teeters over the middle, under throws. Brian, Aaron get on the board for the Redskins. Link with the drop, looks to throw. Rips the pass to Crumrine, gets popped from behind. Ball rolls incomplete. Chet Confidence, yeah. I'm sure of that. You're not kidding. Trips formation. Three guys split wide out right on a third and ten. Aaron Link rolls and oh, bobs away and just way overthrows by almost 15 yards. Brian Crumrine, fourth and ten. Wapakoneta, Scott Fisher will punt, and he'll probably boom that into the end zone. Riders aren't going to be able to field it. It will roll into the end zone for a touchback weekend here in Auglaise County. Rough Riders with the football. Hand off to Mike Compton. The first back through. Storms up to about the 24-yard line. And balanced. Two guys right of center. Five guys left of center. Elston follows the power side. The strong side. But, it, but Eric Sell, how about that? Takes down Elston for a big loss. Eric with a little help from Joe Morgan, though, certainly. Eric Sell, yeah. Third and nine for St. Mary's. They're going to run the football, and Compton gets to the 30. I think he's got the first down. Yeah, he does. How about that? That was Rough Riders back at their own 16-yard line. I don't know. I don't think they're going to throw on third and 14 with a two-touchdown lead. They don't. They play it conservative. They run it to the 20 and up on board and follow us through the parade. Oh, you're going to be down there. Huh? Be down there Sunday in the Roland Radio. Should be a lot of fun. Right. Elston will punt it away from, oh, a bad snap, but Mike fields it, punts it from the 10. Line drive, fumbled by Keck, falls on it at the 48. That only took seven seconds, so Wapakoneta will have time for maybe a couple plays with the wind at there until the full fourth quarter ahead. Got to put a little pressure on St. Mary's. Or this game. Aaron Link takes a snap, rolls, tripped up, lost. Back to his own 45-yard line. Let's see who got in there. Vince Yale, one of the guys. Field, that's the president of my fan club, by the way, Jim. Pitch out, Nate Cornell, 45, ripped out at midfield. Ultimately, a five-yard pickup, Vince Yale. That's kind of an interesting comment. 50 to 12, by the way, that game with Elida. Aaron Link takes the snap, third and two. Link throws, oh my goodness, it's intercepted. What an incredible play. Link was being taken down. Aaron decided to throw it as he was getting taken down. The ball popped. If they can move 30 yards and stick it in the end zone, they're going to put the clampers onto this football game, and they're going to try to push it ahead. They did. <laughs> Carry down to the 24, a six-yard pickup. Compton for good yardage inside the 20 for a Rough Rider first down. Only one more good conference showdown. On a first to 10 from the 19, short yardage. Mike Compton, the pickup for about two. Jason Brown for Wapakoneta. Obviously, the next Rough Riders power eye formation, second and nine. Fred Fry rolls oh and my. way overthrows Mike Elston. Oh, my. And a wide open Mike Elston, frankly. Elston, he was wide open. With the dual setbacks on a third and nine, 18-yard line. Screen pass complete to Elston, 15-10, close to a first down near the nine-yard line. Caught from behind by uh, Darren Fox and uh, Eric Sell for Wapakoneta. I think it's a chance. Rough Riders Compton. easily. First down, Mike Compton on the carry. First down, number 10, as St. Mary's looks to inexorably push this one into the end zone. Hell in this coffin, touchdown, Mike Elston storms into the end zone. Eight minutes, 
57 seconds to play in the football game. Two-point conversion. Fred Fry takes the snap, fakes the handoff, rolls and throws. Two-point conversion complete to Mike Compton. Timeout on the field. Our score, St. Mary's Memorial, 20. Wapakoneta, nothing. We'll <laughs> We may have to talk further about that. <laughs> Nate Cordell for Wapakoneta fields the kickoff in the air at the five-yard line. Excellent return by Nate to the 28. Joe, frankly, tee off up front with those six guys. That's 62. They're going to tee off on Aaron Link. Aaron, option pitch. Cornell, no room at all. Maybe a yard. Nate got the pitch. Three guys staring him in the face. And a big fourth and one defensive stand by St. Mary's, or I should say a singular turnover, and a fourth and one defensive stop by St. Mary's probably stopped the two best opportunities that Wapakoneta had offensively, right? The fourth and one. Variably makes a mistake, and their philosophy turns to gold. Third down and nine from the 29. Wapakoneta pass complete over the middle to Crumrine, and he gets stuck there by Jody Poff. Heck hard line, straight eye formation. Link, quarterback keep, first down. Flag is thrown. Maybe a face mask or something. We'll see. Probably on the defense in that type of a situation. A little pride maybe for Walpa Canada to get on the board. Easier said than done. Link rolls, can't throw, tries to run with it, maybe loses a yard and gets smothered here to the near sidelines. Rough Riders were really hitting hard. 6.20 to play in the football game. Rough Riders lead 20 to nothing. Second and 10. Aaron oh Link bombs away. Away overthrows Mark Schlosser at the 10-yard line. Chet Nows back there defensively. Single setback. Scott Fisher. Oh. Aaron Link. Heavy pressure. Tries the middle screen. Overthrows Fisher. Two uh, Rough Rider defenders bearing down on Aaron had limited options. Fisher will punt the football, by the way, into the win, and he hits a very a excellent kick, taken at the seven-yard line. The return man, Jody Poff, for St. Mary's, wrapped up back at the five. Excellent punt coverage. Wapakoneta is Dave Stedke, a 190-pound senior back there. And Scott has really some pretty good size. He's, well, I guess he's only 165, 5'11", oh so. Inside trap, one step away. <laughs> from breaking it. That was Mouse. Now stock them, wear them down type thing. Now with the power eye formation on second and seven, line of scrimmage to their, their own nine yard line. There he goes. Uh oh, Nows. there's Nouse. Almost breaks it, but is still on his feet all the way to the 31 yard line for 22 yards on the pickup. And another Rough Rider first down, unofficially their 12th of the night. Now they got him as that very brisk wind continues, but it remains short sleeve weather. Excellent conditions tonight. Maybe a little rain tomorrow morning. Nine yards to go for the Rough Riders. Again with the power eye formation. Nows. Hand off to Chet Nows. 40, still on his feet. 45 yard line, 13 yards on the pickup for St. Mary's. Another first down, their 13th, the Wapakinna oh, defense. Right One of the top Division two teams in the state. Fred Fry takes the snap, backpedals, wrapped by Rich Van Voorhees at the 35 yard line, a nine yard loss. And if anything negative can be said about the Rough Riders, and we don't done, he's gonna pass Paterno and Schimbeckler and Hayes and all those guys. I mean, he's kinda, he kinda operates down there and nobody pays much attention to him. And, yeah. Third 18 for Wapakin or for St. Mary's, their own 37 yard line. They're gonna keep it on the ground. Mike Compton will get the carry to about the 43 yards on the pickup. It's fourth and long as we near the two and a half minute mark. And I'll see what kind of records he has. Oh, and Elston to punt the football, fumbles the snap. Wapakinetta converges on Elston and brings him down at the 25. Redskins will take over on downs. Two minutes to play in the And that is what it's all about. First and ten. There they come. Aaron Link sacked back at the 35-yard line. A nine-yard loss for Wapakoneta. They're not going to stop the clock. Back at our T-102 control, they'll be relaying those numbers here in just a moment or so. Straight pitch on a second and long to Nate Cornell for Wapakoneta back to the 35. Not enough to matter. Down to 60 seconds to play in the football game, although just six weeks into the campaign. Aaron oh. Link takes the snap. Lobs it to Schlosser at the five and overthrows Mark. Jody Poff there defensively. 
forest. That's the, that is that's the, that's it from an atmospheric standpoint. But what about in terms of crowd and such? Uh, the crowd is this guy follows his football. Fourth and 13 for Wapakoneta. We're playing out the moments here with 25 seconds to play, and now some flags thrown. Homecoming tonight. So what were his uh, fortes? Oh, he was a guard. He was one of the grunts. Link throws for Wapakoneta. Complete to Mark Schlosser at the 20. Wrapped up by Jody Poff. Short of a first down by quite some distance. First down and uh, talk about letdowns after this night. Huh? Riders will run the football. Mike Compton, final play of the game. Time expires. It's all over tonight from Harmon Field as the St. Mary's Memorial Rough Riders win their 20th straight game. They are 6-0 overall, 5-0 in the conference. And pending the outcome of the Shawnee game tonight, the Rough Riders are clearly the class of the Western Buckeye League. This long time.